Hello, today we're going to talk about how to start a piece that comes in on the and of one. This piece happens to be in two, and uh, these are the gestures that I would like you to consider for this specific choir. So I'll uh, start my hand in uh, conducting preparation area here. Uh, this is the ictus right here. I'm just slightly above that. I always start just slightly above the ictus for everything that I begin. I'm going to give a complete measure before I begin. It'll be one, very small two with a big rebound showing that hey get ready it's almost time to come in and then one and rebound and two and continue your conducting after that okay let's just review that again start here slightly above the ictus one two big rebound one ba -dum -bum -ba. and i believe that this is going to uh, be a helpful gesture for the choir it will get them in on time. I do have to say this, there are other ways to do this. The advantage of the way that I'm showing you is that it gives the uh, choir a full measure, a big prep the beat before. The only thing that is a little bit unusual about this particular conducting gesture is because they come in on the end of one, this big gesture before one maybe makes them think that, oh, they should begin just a little bit sooner than they really do. Uh, I don't know how you can move the bigness of that gesture a half beat over. Uh, if you have suggestions, I think uh, that would be a benefit as well, but it, it's just going to end up being more confusing to the choir. What you're going to need to do, find your ictus, start just slightly above that, always start slightly above your ictus, come to your ictus and click, click your wrist so that they know where the beat is, rebound, small, because you're, they're not singing yet. Uh, come back to the ictus and click on two, big rebound, and this is the prep and the breath for them, and then come down on one, and then kind of a big up, because that's the half a beat on which they enter. All right, let's do that in real time, okay? One, two, oh, sorry about that. Let's try that again. One, two, big one, beat, um, bum, ba. Okay, and just continue to conduct as you go. Okay, one other comment that I would like to make about the conducting that I saw on rehearsal Thursday is that uh, there's kind of a general tendency uh, in your conducting to kind of pull the beat out. And so uh, there needs to be more energy moving toward the beat and maybe a smaller rebound and then back in, bring your energy down into the beat every time so that there's one, two, one, two. And I think that that is kind of going to be the style of the piece that we're singing here. It's not specifically legato. It's got brass with it. It's a little bit punchy. And uh, so uh, conduct like this, and I think that your ensemble will follow along well with you. Thank you.